We're here, Darren Tony Sagan, for our Athlete of the Week. Today we have a few players from the Personal Finance Center Islanders basketball team. Jack? Congratulations on behalf of Darren Tony. Who would you like to donate your check to? We would like to donate it to Micronesian Sports Foundation. You guys are defending champions from the All Island Alumni Tournament held at Guam Elite Center. You guys are currently 4 0, but the team is stacked with talent on this year's roster. Um, yes, we have a bunch of players uh, in the national team, but I think what's making it work for us is our defense and our great chemistry. We're playing together and we're playing for each other. JP, you put up 20 points this last game against uh, the Sharks. What do you attribute your success to on the court playing alongside uh, your fellow Islanders? Well, uh, I just play my game and, um, you know, I would like to thank um, my teammates for letting me do uh, what I do best and, you know, perform and um, contribute whatever uh, I can do in, on the court. You got a leader like Jin Han on the basketball court who's also kind of like uh, the team captain controlling the, the offense and the tempo of the game. You got Billy Belger and Murrah Martin, two guys that have recently came back from the uh, micro games with a gold medal for the national team. And a big man in Jeff Serrano who kind of dominates the game with rebounding. Us guys being uh, knowing each other's role and uh, understanding uh, each other. Uh, how we play and um, pretty much um, we just play together and play our game and, and um, we, we, we play as a team and uh, I think that's our ultimate um, strength pretty much. Personal Finance Center has been on island for quite some time but um, seeing these guys uh, do what they love and, and being out there on the basketball court and, and seeing that the donation that you guys uh, gave to the team is being uh, used for for a great cause. I'm, I'm sure the business and, and the company ha has to be proud about that, representing you guys so well. Um, yes, we are very proud of the JFK team. We're very proud to sponsor you guys, and we're excited to see, you know, more success. All right, congratulations. Stay tuned to our next Darantone Athlete of the Week. KUAM Sports Athlete of the Week is brought to you by... The Guam Women's College Volleyball League will begin their third season of play on Monday, September 10th at the UOG Cabo Fieldhouse. Two-time defending champions, UOG Lady Tritons will face the Guam Community College squad at 6:15, followed by the UOG Tritons club team and Pacific Island University Tide at 7:45. The UOG Lady Tritons are bringing a 16-0 record into Monday night's game. A little showing out before the start of the game as Eagles fans got to take a look at the Super Bowl trophy. Time to turn up after the start of the game was delayed due to some heavy rain. Julio Jones doing some Julio Jones things, leading the Falcons with 10 receptions for 169 yards. Matt Ryan finished the game 21 of 43 for 251 yards and an interception. Philly pulling the okie doke handoff to the running back. Reverse Nelson Aguilar. With the pass back to Nick Foles for the first down, just shy of the 25-yard line, Foles passed for 117 yards on 19 of 34 pass attempts. Jay Ajayi rushed for 62 yards on 15 carries with two scores. The Eagles' defense took over and held it down on the last play of the game for the 18-12 win.